Hi there. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to create computable document format, also known as CDF in Mathematica. So first thing, open Mathematica, create new document. Now here, I'm going to create one plot and show its output to you. Okay. So type in plot function and inside square bracket, use sign into bracket. X and then comma and within curly bracket set the range for X from 0 to let's say 6 close with curly bracket then close with square bracket now shift enter and you have your plot ready now what if you want this plot to be converted into computable document format so that it can be a read on CDF player. Now this can be done from your current Mathematica notebook itself. Go to file and then CDF export. And you have two options web embeddable and standalone. Now web embeddable is used when you want to embed the current plot into some web page say like WordPress post or some other social media post etc and standalone is used when you want to run that data through a CDF player okay so in this video I'm going to show you how to export this for standalone CDF player purpose okay so go to file then cdf export and then standalone now as you can see this has created a dialog box right here and this dialog box asks you to deploy your content into standalone cdf format and it will be shared under creative commons license so that your data will be public and will be reused by others. So if you don't agree to this license, I suggest not releasing your data under CDF. In such case, release it as web embeddable and limit its view to your website only. Okay, now click on continue. Then it asks you question for whether you want to publish entire document or current selection and also where you want to save your file okay now you have to click on this browse button and this should open a dialog box that points to Wolfram Mathematica folder here it shows save as type as CDF computable document change this to CD1 okay and after you do that click on save and now within this text box you can see the full path for storage of that document okay now click on continue and it says your file has been deployed successfully now if you have CDF player installed you can open that file also you can alternatively open that containing folder and then run that file Okay. Now, for now, you can click on this previous button or close button. I suggest clicking on close button and this wizard will be in background. Okay. So, what we have seen so far is creating your notebook data as is and then exporting that content into CDF, also known as computable document and you can either choose to store in your hard disk or web embeddable okay so for this video we export it into standalone cdf document 